Hello, my name is Amy Ecker. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing this eye look and review on the Tardiest Pro Palette. This palette is absolutely beautiful. It's sleek. It's black. It's got some metal and plastic and it is amazing. So this Tardiest Pro Palette is um, part of the Amazonian Clay and let's take a peek on the inside. So on the inside, oh my goodness, ladies, look at these colors. I'm trying not to get any light feedback. And if I do a bad job, please forgive me. So anyways, check out these colors. Um, they are even more vibrant in person than they are on camera. So, um, and I, I can't lie, I am a Tarte fan um, because Tarte always has some creamy eyeshadows that blend so well. And these are no exception. So today, when I did this eye look, um, I used a few colors. I used, uh, let's see, we had some vintage, we had some innocent, we had some no filter, some drama, and um, some minx. And when this minx I actually like better on the eye than in the palette because you can see some of the um, bronze undertones kind of peek through, which is oh, absolutely fun. And then I finished it out with a little bit of punk to smoke out the eye, because as you guys know, I prefer a smoky eye. Natural eyes and me just don't get along, because when I don't do a smoky eye, people always ask if I'm sick. I'm one of those girls. So anyhow, just want to say way to go Tarte, another Christmas type palette um, for you men. Please buy them for you, for your ladies, for you men, please buy them for your men. Um, because again, these colors just have um, a bit of a twist on what we've seen overall come out across the lines. So the even the orange is a little bit of a deep... Um, if it, it's a little bit brighter, but it still is a deep, which I know doesn't make sense. So when I looked at this color Whimsy, I was like, oh my gosh, this is a different spin on some of the oranges that I've seen out. And I had just done a review on the Kylie palette yesterday, so I'm kind of actually liking this orange better than in the Kylie palette. Then, again, I like purples, so I hadn't done purples in a while, which is why I did purples today. But when you get down into here with these pink tones um, I, or pinkish purple tones, I really like those because, again, it's a different spin on what I'm seeing in all these other palettes because right now it just seems like so many palettes have the same colors, just a different name. And these are different. Um, and then, of course, what palette wouldn't be great with a normal um, mid-tone brownish smoky eye so for those ladies that love that with a pop of color this is great um i'm gonna go ahead and swatch these ones right here because these are not the matte ones um so we have trendy we have minx we have glam and we have ethereal so we're gonna look at those because they're almost they're not a deal chrome but my mind's not working so i'm just doing a light hand um, and as you can see, actually that, those do kind of look more like a duochrome. Um, I don't know if it's all picking up on camera. Absolutely beautiful. So these are going to be a lot of fun to play with. This green actually makes me, um, reacts with the light a lot like the Manny palette from Makeup Geek. That's almost an exact dupe right there. And the Manny palette came out earlier this year, maybe at the end of last year, so we hadn't seen this color in a while. This one is the one I used on my eyelid in that bronze tone that picks up in the light. Oh my god, it's beautiful. This light one here is going to be stunning as um, on an eyelid. And then of course here's kind of like a lighter bronzy color. And look, I bear, ooh, look how good that uh, smooths out. So again, these colors um, are going to be great for accent. Actually, I tried a few of these other Tarte palettes for the Christmas kind of collections or, or Christmas gift collections, and I really like those. But I think this one here has um, surpassed the, the Painter's Edition. So if I had a choice between the Painter's Edition and this one for just eyes, I'd, I would love 
this one. However, I still am a fan of this painter's one be just because, again, it's more of a travel case box and you got your little compartment to put things in. So with that being said, um, as far as these two go, which I did a review on this one, not sure if I loaded it yet, but Tarte has done a great job of, for these uh, Christmas season 2016. Thank you again, Tarte, for doing a great, great job. And if you want to see how I came up with this eye tutorial, stay tuned. But don't forget to subscribe. Bye, ladies. Have a great one. Today we're going to use the Tardiest Pro Palette from the Amazon Clay. Look at all these colors. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to get started. So, I think... Oh. Um, I'm either going to do... I really want to do these pinks, but I haven't done purples in a while. So, I think I'm going to go with this row here on the purples and see what happens. Um, I have a feeling this palette will show up a few times because there's so many wow colors that... Um, one video isn't going to be enough. So here we go. Okay, so we're going to start with the vintage all over the eye for a good blending. I think we're going to jump up here to Innocent. Smells good. This palette smells good. We're going to try a bit of this no filter. We're going to use this flat brush for some minks. Look how pretty that is. It's got some copper undertones. I'm going to use the same color Minx on that flat brush. Same flat brush, a bit of this black. I'm 
going to take a very fine pencil brush with that black and just put a little bit down here With a small dome brush, I just popped in on that black, and I'm just going to do little circular motions. Ready for some eyeliner. We're going to use the black, which is called Immortal from Makeup Geek. with our age rewinder and if I seem kind of quiet it's extremely early this morning I have a very early morning appointment that's going to be three hours away so I'm up before the crows I'm not waking up my husband, but I couldn't wait to play with this palette. We've cleaned up and highlighted. Now time for some eyelashes. Waterproof. All right, we're ready to lightly powder. But we can't go without some more Makeup Geek. Because y'all know I'm a Makeup Geek fan. All right, so today's color... I think we're going to go with this one. There's not a day that I don't, that doesn't go by that Makeup Geek doesn't end up somewhere on my face. It's time for hair and makeup. Hair and makeup. I finished my makeup. It's time for hair and then I'll do a review so I'll be right back. Thank you so much for watching this eye tutorial using the Tardius Pro Palette. It's an Amazonian clay additional palette. This was so much fun to put together. I love the colors. If you did like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, make it a beautiful day.